Hello students, how are you all? I hope you are fit and fine. As you all know, we are studying direct and indirect speech and we have completed the exercise and we have discussed a lot of rules of direct and indirect speech. How to change in tenses, how to change in verbs, how to change adverb of place and time and how we are going to change in imperative if it is written in direct speech imperative sentences how we will change in indirect speech so these uh, are the sentences we have discussed uh, in our previous video so uh, yesterday we have completed a uh, number d exercise and today we are going to continue this chapter once again and we will do number e exercise children so uh, all of you please take out your mastering grammar book and uh, this is page number 164 and uh, uh, these are the e number exercise rewrite the following sentences in indirect speech that we are going to do today so children just take out your mastering grammar book Today we are going to complete this is E number exercise rewrite the following sentences in indirect speech which you can find on page number 164. So the first one is the vendor told the customer that he had sold all the apples but, uh, but some oranges and bananas are left for you. The vendor said to the customer, I have sold all the apples, but some oranges and bananas are left for you. So now we are going to change. We are going to write this uh, number one exercise in indirect speech. So let's start children. Now this is E number exercise. And we are going to complete number one. So I hope it is clear to you. So the vendor the vendor told the customer told the customer that he had that he had sold all the apples all the apples but but some oranges But some oranges and bananas and bananas and bananas are left for him. So we have completed number one exercise that is the vendor told the customer that he had sold all the apples uh, but some oranges and bananas are left for him. So we have completed this. Now we are going to do second number. So children please start writing. Now second number we are going to write. Mr. Narang said to the mechanic, I have a problem because I have to leave immediately and my car needs repair. So let's start writing this. Number two. 
Number two, we are going to write. Mr. Naran told the mechanic. Told the mechanic. Mechanic. That he had a. That he had a that he had a problem because he had to leave because he had to leave. immediately immediately because his car needs repair immediately and his and his car needs repair So, complete it children, write it down or take a screenshot. That is, Mr. Naran told the mechanic that he had a problem because he had to leave immediately and his car needs repair. So, uh, we are going to do third number. So, write it down children. Number three. Number three we are going to write. Number three is, she said to her friend, I will invite Nalini also for dinner tomorrow. She said to her friend, I will invite Nalini also for dinner tomorrow. So let's start writing number three. Number three. She told her friend, she told her friend, she told her friend that, that she would, she would invite she would invite she would invite Nalini Nalini for dinner the next day for dinner the next day so completed children, she told her friend that she would invite Nalini for dinner the next day. So write it children. Now we are going to complete next number, number 4. Number 4 we are going to do. Number 4 is... Sagar said, I will wait here for my parents. Now here, Sagar said, I will wait here for my parents. So number five, we are going to, number four, we are going to do. Number four. So Sagar told, Sagar said, Sagar said, that he that he that he 
would wait that he would wait wait there for his parent for his parents so sagar said that he would wait there for his parent so completed children number 5 we are going to do number 5 is aditi said to ankit your file is on the teacher's table aditi said to ankit your file is on the teacher's table so now here we are going to sit we are going to write number 5 Aditi told Ankit Ankit that his file his file was on the table was on the teachers teachers table for a stop so number 5 is aditi told ankit that his file was on the teachers table now children we have completed this e number exercise now we are going to complete number f exercise which you can find on page number 165 so children please uh, turn over your page page number 165 we are going to complete it so this is exercise number f rewrite the following sentences in direct speech so it is already given in indirect speech and we have to convert in in uh, sorry direct speech so first he says that he is fond of mangoes now here we are going to write in direct speech number f exercise this is we are going to do number 1 so he says he says he says after that we are just put comma and we are going to write over here inverted comma i am fond of or mangoes i am fond of mangoes mangoes and here inverted comma close and full stop will be there so this is a uh, direct speech we are writing direct speech now we are going to do number 2 second number we are going to write the second number is The officer told Mr Gupta that he should apply for a new passport immediately. Now we should write in direct speech. So let's start writing children. The officer said to me The officer said to me said to me said to mr gupta sorry said to mr gupta mr gupta 
inverted comma start so we will write over here my uh, he should he will that i will apply for a new appointment for a new appointment immediately now number 3 Number three, it is uh, written. Garima told me that her father had gone out on tour and would return the following week. So now we are going to do this. So uh, now we are going to write. Garima said to me. So number three, Garima. said to me my father inverted comma start so here my father my father had gone out had gone out on tour sorry here we are going to write has has gone out on tour on tour and will return and will return the next week the next week so here we have completed this garima said to me now you can see garima said to me my father has gone out on tour and will return the next week so we have completed this and now we are going to do fourth one that is mini said that she wanted to go to a hill station that week so you just write it down i am going to erase it so we are going to complete fourth number fourth number number 4 number 4 is mini said mini said comma then inverted commas start i want to go i want to go a hill station a hill station a hill station this week this week now inverted comma close and full stop will be there so here what we have done that we have written that mini said i want to go a hill station this week so we have completed this uh, exercise exercise number f now we are going to do our next exercise which you can find on page number 166 that is g number exercise so please children take out your uh, uh, 
grammar mastering grammar as you you have taken out already and just turn over the page 166 and we are going to complete number g exercise So we are going to do G number exercise. So in this exercise, we are going to complete, rewrite the following sentences in direct speech. Again, we have to complete in direct speech. So uh, children, please uh, take out your pages and we should write on the page because we have to rewrite this. That old lady requested Seema to help her carry the basket of fruits. Now we are going to write in direct speech. Now requested become said to. So we are going to write number one. The old lady said to said to Seema Seema, now, please now inverted comma start. Please help me to carry the basket of fruits basket of fruits now number 1 we have completed now we are going to do number 2 number 2 is the gardener warned the children not to throw empty cans in the lawn now here it is written, the gardener warned the children not to throw empty cans in the lawn. Now we are going to do this. The gardener said to, direct speech we are writing, the gardener, gardener said to the children, said to the children said to the children now inverted commas start that do not do not throw empty cans in the lawn in the lawn inverted comma close and full stop will be there so completed children or take a screenshot so we are going to do next one Now next number is, that is uh, third number, the ticket checker requested him to show his ticket before, before he entered the movie hall. The ticket checker requested him to show his ticket before he entered the movie hall. Now we are going to write in direct speech. So this is uh, number three. Number three we are writing. So the ticket checker said to him, the ticket checker said, to him 
Now, inverted comma I'll start. Said to him, please show your movie ticket, movie ticket before you. before you enter the movie hall enter the movie hall inverted comma close for the stop so the ticket checker said to him please show your movie ticket before you enter the movie hall so we have completed this now we are moving to next one that is father ordered the car cleaner to clean the car uh, to clean the rear view mirror properly father ordered the cl car cleaner to clean the rear view mirror properly so we are going to write number 4 of exercise number g father said to the car cleaner now we are writing number 4 father said to the car cleaner cleaner now inverted commas start clean clean the rear view mirror properly inverted comma close father said to the car cleaner clean the rear view mirror properly so completed children and now we have completed this uh, g number exercise after completing uh, exercise number g we are going to start exercise number h which you can find on the same page 166 so uh, in this exercise number h rewrite the following sentences in indirect speech and uh, we have completed g number exercise to write in direct speech but in this exercise we are going to complete in indirect speech so we should write in indirect speech so start writing or well, we are going to complete this exercise exercise number h so number 1 is aditya said many trees are cut to build roads so here we are going to write in indirect speech now number 1 aditya said that aditya said that many trees many trees were cut to build to build roads so first we have completed now we are going to do number 
Number two is Sunakshi said to him, the new packets of cookies is yours. So now we are going to do Sakshi told him Sunakshi Sunakshi told him that that the new packets the new packets the new packets packets of cookies was his cookies was his so second we have completed write it down children or take a screenshot now we are going to complete number three number three is Pratibha says that Pratibha says I am in the library Pratibha says I am in the library so we are going to do this uh, number three Pratibha says Pratibha says Pratibha says that she is that she is in the library in the library so you just complete it for the stop will be there in the library so third number we have completed so we will do next exercises uh, in our next video so you just complete third one exercise number H we have completed three number exercise and we will do more exercise in our next video so completed children revise this chapter once again and we will continue this chapter in our next video so till then bye bye and take care